Thank you, Sphere Rocket team. Uh, this has been a trip of a lifetime for me. Uh, I will never forget you guys. My name is Joel Perso. I'm the Chief Operating Officer. Hi, I'm Gianna, and I am a Business Development Manager for Sphere Rocket VA. Uh, my name is Moose Reed. I'm the sales director over at Sphere Rocket Virtual Assistants. Matt Golba, VP of Sales. Uh, my name is Tori Hunter, and I am the events manager here at Sphere Rocket. My name is Gabe Hall, and I'm one of the sales managers at Sphere Rocket. Uh, Justin announcing that everybody in the company is getting a raise and watching the entire team get up and dance and cheer uh, is incredible. <laughs> Oh my goodness, all of it. Um, I have to say, my introduction was so fun. Um, getting everybody ramped up, cheering for me, and then running through like I was famous, high fives. Um, that was a lot of fun. One of my favorite part of the night was just the dancing. I think it was incredible. I don't understand how team two won when team one was way better, so that's my vote. My favorite part of the team party was just getting to integrate with the entire team, getting, every, getting a chance to put a face to everybody's name. Um, getting a chance to build actual relationships instead of meeting them through Skype and through FaceTime uh, and through text message, getting to put an actual face to the person instead of just a Facebook message. Two years, JB for example, I've you know, been seeing this guy on team meetings and stuff for the last few years and uh, actually got to meet him in person, so really cool. Um, yeah, it was just super fun. Getting to meet everybody. Um, we see these people all the time and we chat all the time with our VAs over Messenger, but actually being able to see them in person and give them hugs and love on each other was just absolutely incredible and it was the experience, an experience that I will never ever forget. I thought it was really cool that there were uh, so many of the team practiced and performed these like dances uh, and showcases. It was really cool they put all the time into that and that was really entertaining and super fun to see what you do. For me, it was especially neat to meet the people that I talk to on a regular basis. So Shireen, Renee, Michelle, uh, Norlene, Camille, uh, the ones who I have a lot of interaction with getting to meet in person was, uh, was awesome. Probably Jefferson. He was a total sweetheart and he was so fun. And uh, you know, I really enjoyed meeting CK and MJ and um, Albin and everybody, but um, Jefferson was just, just a little peach. So I loved meeting him in, in real life. My favorite VA to meet was definitely Michelle, but honestly the entire content and marketing team have been incredible. Uh, my dudes work super hard behind the scenes. I can see them right now taking photos of Joel just sitting on the couch and it makes no sense. because MJ, Joe, uh, Melody, uh, CK was super cool to meet for the first time. My favorite VA to meet for the first time was probably CK and I think the reason behind it is because I see her dancing on TikTok all the time and she's always so spunky and turned on and happy and lively and she that's not just on video, that's just not for the TikTok, she is actually that person in real life and so um, that was really exciting to meet her and I hugged her probably about 50 times. I don't know if I could say that I have a favorite. Um, I didn't get to meet everybody and I wish I did. Every, everyone that I met was so cool, awesome. One thing I took away, um, I have never been more convinced that we've got a, a world-class team at Spear Rocket. And uh, you know, we, we knew that from all the work that's being produced, um, the conversations we have, but getting to see everybody together um, yeah, I'm totally convinced that we've got the best team anywhere. After hanging with 50 plus of our team members, I took away a full heart. They are so fun and all smiles and, you know, it really uh, brought perspective to the morale that they have here with the company and how much they care and how excited they were to see us. Um, I don't think anybody has ever been that excited to see me and my heart is so full. Um, it is an amazing group of people who are always happy, always excited and ready for a good time. And that is one thing I learned with hanging out with 50 plus people for a few hours. The team is so hungry for opportunity and they're such strong workers, but even though they're super strong workers, um, they also really have a strong sense of community and they know how to let loose. They're so excited for us to be a part of their community uh, and they're so excited to be integrated with us as well. Since we've arrived, pretty much everybody on the team has made us feel like we're a part of the family. How kind everybody is and how thankful all of our VAs are to be working for Sphere Rocket. Um, Sphere Rocket truly changes lives and 
last night really put that into perspective for me, how thankful they really are to be here. Uh, how diverse our team is, I, I just didn't expect that. Like everybody is, is so unique and um, has so many amazing, unique qualities about them. And I feel like everybody I met um, was just vibrant and, and different. We have a really, really cool team with a lot of cool personalities, cool talents. and. Yeah, I think uh, my advice would be um, simple, but just to keep going. I think perseverance is one of the most important skills that you can learn in life, um, so just keep going. Uh, everything uh, will pass. The good things pass, bad things pass, so just keep going. Tomorrow could be better, but tomorrow could also be worse, and just know that this too shall pass, and um, your, your feelings are always valid. And I think all of us have to go through those trials so we can come out to be better people. Right? Through the fire and flames is how we actually are able to cultivate a better life, a better experience. And so if you're struggling through things and you're trying to figure out, hey, what's next for my life? Or what am I trying to do that'll help further it? Just know that those struggles are really gonna help push you forward. And then know the Sphere Rocket family is always there for you. There's no need to ask for, permit, for permission. They can just go out and, uh, and do it and execute it and increase their income, et cetera. So that's something that Casey and Angelo have done so well. That's why they've been growing with me at such a fast rate. Um, yeah, you've got a lot of options as far as just, you know, finding those people um, that can support you and help you grow into, uh, you know, the person that you need to be and, and kind of out of the pit that you may be in. Use your support system because support is huge when you're struggling. And if you don't have the support, then you're going to continue to struggle. So just reach out to the people around you. But in addition, just keep reaching out to the people around you to make sure that they're okay as well because everybody struggles at times and it's just important to just be kind to each other at all times. At least as far as work things go, so I just kind of remember experiences like this and remember what I'm doing it for. Um, and, and fun times like this make, make the hard times worth it. Um, so having something to look forward to, um, which we, we often do being on a team like this, gets me through the hard times and I, I hope that gets people, other people through the hard times as well. Uh, thank you, Sphere Rocket team. Uh, this has been a trip of a lifetime for me. Uh, I will never forget you guys. I have enjoyed every single second of it. I've loved it all. Um, you guys were so kind, but I have loved every single second of it. I know how much hard work went into that. And each and one of you, I want you to know that you are special to us. You're special to me. You can always reach out to me at any time. And thank you for your hospitality and making me feel so special. But Shireen is amazing. If I could have a billion of her, that would be great because I could call her about a van service, a hotel room reservation, food. I can ask her to bring up Dorito chips to my room and somehow she knows it all. And um, it has been an incredible experience to have someone like her um, that really knows how to manage a team, manage expectations, and manage the experience that we have here, here in the Philippines. So i um, super, super grateful for the hospitality of this team and the way we're able to coordinate everything logistically and as well as making sure we all have a great time. It's been awesome meeting you guys so far. It's been awesome hanging out with you guys. I appreciate you guys introducing us to your family, feeding us, partying with us, making sure I didn't get too out of control, making sure that I got back to my room safely. Uh, guys, appreciate you guys having a ton of fun with us. I just feel like we're, we're you know, part of the, the culture, uh, we, we felt accepted uh, from day one, um, the kind of going above and beyond. One thing too, like uh, just as like a example, um, I had mentioned, or Kale had mentioned something to me about like, hey, the honey here is like really good. I was like, oh dude, I love honey. And then MJ shows up last night with a bottle of like locally sourced honey. Uh, and, and it's just like, you know, the, the little attention to details. It's really cool. So um, huge thank you to everybody. Huge thank you to Shireen and Justin for putting on the event. Um, you know, just continuing to put their best foot forward um, and make sure that everybody's taken care of. This is my first time ever being out of the United States. So I'm in a bit of a culture shock, but it has been the best experience of my life. Everybody is so welcoming, so kind, and I never want to leave. I want to stay here forever. I probably asked about 10 different VAs last night if I could live with them and they all said yes. So if I ever if, if I ever go missing, I'm probably at Iris's house in the Philippines. I don't know how much I can say thank you to the team. Like everybody's been so welcoming, so hospitable. Um, I, have, I have felt so welcomed and so in place the whole time I've been here um, and Edie has as well. Um, yeah, it's, I have never experienced this level of hospitality, so thank you, thank you, thank you so much.
that next time I see these people, we're gonna be so much further ahead in our goals. Um, I hope they'll be further ahead in their personal goals. Um, so looking back on where we were right now um, and seeing how much we accomplish. I am looking forward to more karaoke because we had so much fun with each other. Um, they're amazing here. I was embarrassed to get on stage compared to the talent that they have, um, but I will say that it was so funny. Um, just the serenades we went through, bringing flowers to the stage and one-upping each other with um, chairs and walkers and um, even humans. So I think that, um, you know, that sense of humor that we all share is something that I look forward to starting now until the next time. I can't wait to laugh and smile with y'all. If it's possible, I would love to spend a day with uh, the content guys and be able to just shoot whatever we want to shoot and just go out on a creative mayhem and just just pump out content like content has never seen before here in the Philippines. It'd be super exciting to do that. Either way, I'm just excited to see the team again. I mean, I think we've all blossomed into better people, better version of ourselves, and I look forward to coming back to the Philippines later on in life. Sorry, I'm gonna go back to the conversation with Angelo, but we spent so much time talking about the future and things that we're going to implement. And even though we talk about it on a day-to-day -day basis, it was still really good to get a chance to talk to him about it in person. So we're really just scratching the surface of our relationship and the things that we're going to implement over the next couple of months. I'm really excited to see how his career and how his opportunity is going to grow. It'd be really cool to you know spend a, a few more days with kind of the entirety of the team. Um, you know, feel like last night just it was so amazing. Wish it kind of could extend. Um, so it'll be cool to have that, maybe some just, uh, you know, open lines of communication with uh, some of the VAs, things like that. Actually being able to see them and um, be with them and party with them was an amazing experience. I'm also looking forward to hearing Michelle sing again because her voice is absolutely incredible. Um, and watching everybody dance, everybody is just so talented. So I'm excited to hug them all again and just party with them. All of the, the newness of the Philippines will be out of the way. I already have been here once, um, so I'll just kind of know where to go, what I like, what to do, and just kind of get right down to business and have fun with everybody. I'm really excited to come back um, and spend more time with the team because it's been awesome.